Hey everyone, uh, I won the roll, uh, cap seven, Jeremy cap six. Yeah. Ready? Yeah, we are. I'm going to try a well, place a little bit weirder than I might normally. I'm going to start with a mute vault and pass turn. Holy moly. Um, play a shrine cat. Here we go. Play a swamp. Turn the mute vault. Hit you for two. Oh, you got it. Aggro. Aggro. Pass turn. Aggressive. Uh, courtyard. Hmm? And Lone Rider. Yeah. Uh, you go. Go ahead if you want to. I, I used to play him. I used to have a, the, He's jank, great. the jankiest life gain deck. It was like 110 cards. Yeah. But uh, back before I like, got past Kitchen Top, and I had him in there, and I just had to remember what he did again, so like, it's been so long. All right, draw for turn. I'm going to play a swap as an after turn. I'm going to tap three, and I'm going to play my friend, the Unstoppable Slasher. You got it. Pass the turn. Shelter by ghosts. Yeah. What's it do again? Uh, enchant mine and mm -hmm. exile. Yeah, exactly. rings that until it uh, that leaves. Yep. Okay. Uh, swing two. All right. I will take two. Gain two. Uh, a year ago. Okay. It doesn't give it any other kind of protection, correct? It does. It gives it ward two. Ward two. Okay. Yes. Okay. And is it just come back onto the battlefield? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well. Three mana. We're gonna offspring a vine slasher. Okay. Let the dice go. This is just a little bit. One. And then I'm gonna play a Nick. That's his land for turn. He'll take two. Oh yeah. Eighteen. Uh, and then I'll pass turn. Where are all my stinking lands? Um. It's always a tenant. Yeah. Um, yep. Thank you. Sir. He didn't get one yet. He gets one. Yep. One dark. Uh, go to combat. Yep. Swing for three. Three uh, first strike lifelink. No blocks. I'll go to 15. Uh, go to my end step. Yep. He transforms. Mm -hmm. uh, you go. Oh, and I gained, so I'm up to 21. I would have actually prefer a swamp. Uh, go to combat? Yeah. Swing a 1 2. You got it. Uh, second main phase, I will pay 1 and a ward of 2 to Fatal Push, since it's still a CMC 2 creature. Uh, yeah, you got him. Get my slasher back. And then I will pass the turn. That was really good. I, I was thinking about doing it last turn, but I'm like, I, yeah, you can flip it, but it still dies to be pushed. Oh, man, I must be happy. So I'm a lieutenant. Yep. Um, say go. Go ahead, say he's got two dozen in on top. I don't know if my deck loves me or hates me. Uh, well, Nick, though, still only taps for three. So, I'm going to have to do this first main phase because uh, I have to at least threaten it. Blood letter? Yep. Uh, go to combat? Yep. Swing a 2 3 death touch, and if it hits you, you die. Yeah, I'm going to. Block it. Yep. And they will technically trade, so he dies, then he comes back, tap, two stun counters on. Yep. And then it will be your turn. Sure. Yeah. There's a couple connections here, though. Tenacity. Yeah. Uh, Sago. Untap. Remove a stun counter. Uh, so Nykthos now taps for one, two, three, six. I guess that's good enough. Um, 
We'll tap Nykthos for six. Wait, yeah, it doesn't matter. I'm not gonna have enough for me to vault anyways. Moving him down a moment. Um, so, six black, we'll use four of it, down to two, and play a Blood Litter. Okay. And then add another black and play a Unholy Annex. So that's at the beginning of my end step, I draw a card. If I control a demon, each opponent loses two life and I gain two life, otherwise, I gain, I lose two life. Yep, yep. So I'll go to combat, I'll swing a 2 4 in the air that will hit you for eight. Yep. All right. Go to 12. I will go to end step. Yep. I will draw a card and you will lose eight more life. Jesus. And I will gain two life. Hey, at least the life gain isn't yeah, scaled yeah, as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, and I'll pass turn. All right, good game. Can't do anything. Can I, can I get the land? I could. So the the elegant way I would have ended it was, what better? Swap. <laughs> you yeah. for like twenty. <laughs> Let's see. It would have been one. Technically, Odin four, two, four, eight, sixteen. I get it. Yeah. Just death. <laughs> but yeah, I, I drew three blood letters. I'm like, I don't know if my deck's trolling me or what. Like I, I'm at the right amount of mana, but I also like I just. Want to cast other things too, but I mean, oops, all blood letters. I can't, <laughs> I can't say no to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really good. <laughs> yeah, the the way the math goes up is uh, awesome. It's like doubling season, but for life loss. <laughs> some of these cards in, but at the same time, I'm still not totally comfortable with the sideboard enough to, to actually make the call. So instead, I'll just do this one. One that I like quite a bit. I only have one copy of, much to my discipline. I actually probably have more copies I price out on top of them. That's how it goes with the new cards. They're in a box somewhere completely unsorted. <laughs> so much mana. Last round against Matt in game two, they pretty much got me through the what would have been just a grinding slugfest where we're seeing who can draw their top deck win condition first. <laughs> I'm super good in play. Yes. I have the extra draw. So, yeah, it's the same game. Um, you play a little double block of yeah. one of them. Yeah. You go. They're two one and one. Huh? Yeah. It paid off. Um, oh. I'm going to play a yeah. swamp. So, I'm going to tap it. Yeah. And I'm going to play my friend, a lasher. Mm -hmm. Pass turn. Caves. Mm -hmm. I'll play. One one rider. Yeah. Uh, say go. One one first strike. Cool. Okay. Um, play a K 
cavern is land for turn. Take one. Mm -hmm. I you take, take one. one. Oh, yep. Yep. yep, landfall. And then I'll go to combat and I'll swing a one, two at you. You got it. Uh, second main phase. I'm going to tap two. We're in a demonic council. I'm going to grab a blood letter and it'll be your turn. Okay. I cannot block. I will take the one. Okay. Go to 19. Uh. Yeah, you gain life, each opponent loses a life, so that has me on a little bit of a clock. And you make a, at the beginning of your end step, if you lost life, which you paid the two, uh, you gain a pet. Okay. And I lose one. Yes. You gain one. Uh, year ago. Alright. Well, on time. Draw. Play a Nykthos as a land return. Take one. Oh, yep, yep. I'm going to try and harder the cards that I guess in a weird way and uh, have to hope I hit another land. I'm going to Offspring a Vine Lasher. Nice. Now I got three of them. That's one. Five, so I'll pick a track. So you exile you're going to go in. Yeah, yeah, no, it's. Yep. We'll exile it, and then. You're good. If, if we come across one, you've got to come across one. No, there is the only one. I don't know. Okay. I'll just shuffle. No, that's fine. Okay. Uh, I get a three, three. So. I will pay one. For a. Paying a life? Yes. Okay. Um, Look at I have one black man over. Yeah. So he's a tenant. Uh, so I can play him, but I don't know if I can play him for um, Go to combat? Yep. Swing two. Pay to lift if you haven't gained another one yet. No blocks. Okay. Go to 16. And go up to 17. Uh, go to my end. Yep. I will lose a life. Um, and you get bat. And I will signal. Heart of the cards. I have gotten some good heart of the cards tonight. Three mana. I'm going to offspring a vine back. <laughs> good lord. I'm going to play Castle Lockway in his land return. Take five. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> Go to 12. Um, pass turn. Look, if I just top deck lands from here on out, I think I can win. I think you can too. <laughs> And I'll pay one. Yep. I'll say at this point, if I just top deck the land, it might be. You get some life gain coming, though. I think it's two. Uh, swing three. Well, four, sorry. Yeah, that is lifelink this time. Well, you're going to gain life either way. It doesn't matter if it hits me, so. Yeah, okay. I take four. Okay. Go to 11. Go to 14. Uh, go to my step. Yeah. I go to 10. You'll get another bat. Yes. And I will say go. Okay. Well, the good news is for me, this taps for five. So I'm going to have to start with that. I'm going to tap five, float, basically leaving one and play a blood letter. Yep. 
suit that no. Like, no. I was like, you're going to try to do the block the thing? Yeah, and then the virtue is over here. I gain two from the virtue. I'm just not totally sure exactly which one of these ends up being the best play at the moment. We're in a precarious situation. We're going to pay two, and we will know where to run the Thalia's of Ten. That's a 3-3. Three, three. Okay. Uh, and this stays out on the battlefield, and if I do draw anything of high mana value, I will have mana for it. Uh, if not, I will be praying for my life next turn, I think, because if I were to swing in, you would chump, chump, so chump, chump, you take four, not worth it. Pass through. Shelter by ghosts. Yep. Take your blood letter. Okay. Um. Go to combat. Mm -hmm. Swing for seven. <laughs> Uh, I... that has trample, so no blocks. I'll go to three. And I'll go to two, but... Um, I'm gonna put yep, go to end step. Yep. Good. Uh, here go. See, unfortunately, the kill spell in hand is the wrong spell. I have them. I don't know. That's only well, I have, I have the actual phone with tokens. Okay. What can I do? One, two, three, four, five, six mana. Seven total mana. Alright, do I have a board for you? This doesn't actually get me anything. This kills me. I can't make this not kill me. Don't think I have a way out. I don't know. I don't know much about D&D, but I assume that that's not cool. So this would be five damage. <laughs> this doesn't matter because you have trample and fly. This can only remove one creature, not the important one. So you pretty much have lethal last turn. But um, just for the sake of it, I'm just gonna use this. I'm gonna channel attack a new one. Just see what's there. Okay. Really? Oh. I guess return a lily to my hand, and uh, that would be four mana. That was two, so I'll play a lily, and I'll make you sacrifice a creature. Okay. Oh. And then, then you got it. All right. <laughs> I had an edict in hand, oh. and I should just played it way earlier, but I was kind of trying to set it up. Well, look, you you draw three vine lashers, and you want to play the lizards. Yeah. Yep. No, I agree. And then, yeah, honestly, actually, me not hitting lands. Was hurting because with blood letter that was ten damage on the field. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But then also him yeah. gave me some problems. Well, at least that does tell me that this is not the deck I want those in for. So the edicts come out because you make too many creatures. They are better against people who like indestructible things. <laughs> I'll be on the play. Okay. Nice. I came one or two. <laughs> two. Okay. So I thought it was, but at the same time, I'm like, I, I'm just like losing track of time tonight. Like, look, there's been so many flashing lights out there with the bus and the ambulance, so. Hmm. I'm just distracted by the, the flashing lights. Yeah. Shiny things. At least I assume it's ambulance. It might be a fire truck. No. Hmm. No idea. Yeah, it's a lot of flashing lights. There's some hazards. There's uh, some wee woo lights. 
Yeah. No blue, just red. Who knows, maybe it's a, like a record that's telling somebody and that's just their warning lights. Nice. We caught him, he's at the Taco Bell. <laughs> Where else would he be? Good luck, good sir. Good luck. Someone say Pootie Tang? Knowing them, probably. I'll keep. Oh, I really want to, but I know it's like I shouldn't. <laughs> it's really good. Was it like a one lander? Yeah, I get a lot of those. I'm glad I didn't. How many lands do you run? Small. Oh, only two. Oh, that's not that bad though. Look, at my aggro decks, I was running 19. Right. Jerry well, like, this isn't uh, really. This is. That's fair. It's not. This, this deck it's can. It's more mid rangey combo, but. It can. I don't even think it's a combo. Like, it has synergy. I think it would be like number 10 on synergy. Like, everything. That's true, because nothing actually just like kills on the spot or anything. Right. Okay, it's just, just slow value drain. So yeah, so well, mid range. And like a human show. Yeah. Which makes it kind of weirdly aggro. Is, how much better is the human? Are, do the human are the humans for you over the bats? Um, minus Zoralan, I feel like I'm hitting my life link a lot faster tonight. Like my bats are showing up every time. Now. Yeah. Um, minus the Zoralan, I like it. I almost want to put Zoralan. Yeah. You know, is there does Zoralan care about bats? I thought you just cared about. It, it, it does. Oh, okay. I thought you cared about. You know, CMC whenever you um, three. Whenever you attack with a bat, you gain one life. Oh, but you, you make bats, and he's a bat. Right. Yeah. So I might put him back in here. But really, just the weird life gain triggers. Yeah. Uh, the Coinsmith. The Coinsmith is really good in this deck. You know, Optimistic Scavenger, Coinsmith. You get a counter and you gain a life. Turn three is convocation for paying for it. You know, you gain a life for the enchantment. Yeah. It, it's very different. Yeah. But... There's also, you know, turn one, one drop, turn two, two more, one drops, turn three, Thalia. Yep. <laughs> you know, like, there's, yeah. it's, it's very different. So I used to play mono white humans. I, I, I liked it because when I first was getting the format, I didn't want to have to know everything. Like, I didn't want right. to, like, I just want to play. It was like, I just want to play my deck. It's like, all right, I'm going to play a deck that pilots itself, basically. And then eventually I just got bored of it. I'm like, I need something new. Nice, that's sweet. That's a good place for me to be. Beautiful. Right. You good? Beautiful. Yeah, but no. <laughs> but yeah. Swam. All right. Uh, one. Go to 16. Um, Creativity is beautiful. Courtyard. Here we go. Castle Lockwing. Go. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Case. Mm -hmm. Lone Rider. Okay. I don't know what you're reading. You're on step. Yeah. Go for it, bro. <laughs> I, yeah, he not, carried your last game. He lost. Not this game. Draw for turn. <laughs> uh, we will play a Swamp as land for turn. Tap three. And we'll play a Unstoppable mm, Slasher. Mm. Pass turn. I see. I see. To be fair, at least I killed him on your end step and didn't try to, like, Play this and then kill a creature when you only have one blocker. Vanishing verse. Uh, just exile, right? Okay. Yeah. Target monocolor. Yeah. Cool, cool. Uh, you're cool. It's pretty solid removal against the creature that comes back. Mm -hmm. um, okay. Okay. So I think I know how we're gonna keep playing the hand from here. We'll play another castle lock mm -hmm. I will tap three. I'm gonna play a unholy annex. Okay. I do not have a demon, so when I go to end step, I will lose two, and I will draw a card. All right. It'll be your turn. Mm. Uh, caretakers. Yeah. Uh, your go. Are we racing here? I feel like we're racing here. That's just always so tempting, but it's not the right thing to do. It's right to not hurt myself anymore. I'm unlocking this room. 
and okay. I'm making a 6-6 six, six demon. Of course I do that. I'll go to end step. Uh, mm -hmm. You'll lose two. I gain two, and I draw a card. Zapier demon. Is that, is that non land permanent? Yep. So you're, is it? Just make sure you know. Remember, it is a permanent creature. Right. So uh, here you go. Okay. On tap. Was he? Currently? He's a two one. Okay. Well, I'm gonna kind of have to be hurting this turn because you exile the demon of mine. I'm going to tap three, and I'm going to play my best friend, the Vine like Lasher. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play a Takanuma as land for turn, you'll take two. And I'm going to pay two. I know it's instant speed turn because it's flash, but I don't care. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give it minus three, minus three, uh, since Ward no longer triggers for it. Uh, then I will go to end step, I will lose two, and I'll draw a card. Here you go. So, yeah. the Hall, the Hallbreaker horror was in the second. I know you did it, but it's actually used it last year. I mean, into the skull. For the three yards. Yeah. Here you go. Alright. On top. Draw. One card in hand? Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah. Five men? No, I need four of them. Uh, I'm gonna Grievous Wound on you. So you can't gain life anymore, finally. Mm -hmm. And when you're dealt damage, you lose half your life rounded up. Jesus, okay. Play a swamp. You'll take a damage, and you'll take two damage triggers on the stack. So you'll take one, go to 14, half down to seven. Okay. Then you'll take one, go to six, half down to three. Jeez. Um, and then I'll go to combat swing both. I think it's lethal if you don't have a removal. Because you'll take one, go no, no, you, you, you'd be at one, that's right. Yep, because it's not an odd number. Um, and this guy dies because he was a 1 1. And. I did another shatter. I will go to my end step, and I don't control a demon, so I lose two life. And I draw a card. I had a demon, it could have been. Yeah. Huge turn, by the way. Huge yeah, turn. no, 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 yeah. Um, that's. Yeah, I can't do yeah. anything. Uh, Good games. Grievous Moon might actually be the most explosive card in the deck because it's that. Yeah, we, I, I killed can do people that. a week or two ago by literally having four Vine Lashes on the field. They're at, I think it's 16s where it's lethal. I just play that, play land for turn, they die. Yeah, that's insane. Like, uh, good okay. games. Yeah, good really games. Good. Vanishing Verse is good. 